interesting topics regarding the reproduction in organism. So, in yesterday video, we have learned that how the asexual reproduction takes place in case of some of the organisms. So, today let's move on to the next level that is how this asexual reproduction takes place. Apart from the single cell organisms or lower cell organisms, how this asexual reproduction takes place in case of some simple plants and also in case of some higher plants. So, some simple plants like uh, that is common algae, we know that chlamydomonas. How come, how does the asexual reproduction takes place in case of the chlamydomonas? This chlamydomonas algae produces zoospore structures which are the asexual reproductive structures of that algae. During favorable condition, it grows into mature cells and becomes new individual. However, apart from the asexual reproduction, this chlamydomonas during unfavorable condition, it goes through some sexual reproduction and produces its own offspring. Not only the chlamydomonas, some of the fungi and algae also go through the sexual reproduction. Well, let's move on to the next level how the asexual reproduction takes place in case of the higher plants. We know that Asexual reproduction is also known as a vegetative propagation. In case of higher reproduction, higher plant reproduction, we use that word vegetative propagation. In case of higher plants, asexual reproduction is nothing but the vegetative propagation where a specialized part of structure of the plant itself involves in giving up the new offsprings. So for instance, let me give you an example, potato. Where the stem of the potato having a bird like a, or a tube like a structure which we, which we call it as eye. So we call it as eye of the potato. In turn what does it do is it grows into a bird like. That means that only grows into a new potato which leads to new offspring of the potato. And next we can take the ginger plant. This in this ginger plant, the modified stem or the rhizome itself has a bud and some nodes on its plant body. The bud itself grows into new ginger plant, and the node which produces or which modifies later into adventitious roots, and they help in the absorption of water and minerals from nutritive materials from the soil. This is how the reproduction or the asexual reproduction takes place in case of the ginger plant. And on the other hand, bryophyllum leaf. How come the asexual reproduction takes place in this plant? There is a presence of a notch like a structure on the margin of the bryophyllum leaf where it produces a notch bud like structures and it also produces the bird like structures which later modifies into adventitious roots. At some stage, they get detached or they get fall off from the leaf, from the margin of the leaf and grows into new individual. This is how the, this is how the asexual reproduction takes place in case of the bryophyllum. And not only in these cases, but also these vegetative propagules like a runner, sucker, offset, bulbil, bulb in onion and uh, runner in case of for example runner occurs in case of strawberries. This is how the asexual reproduction takes place in these higher plants. And now today we have discussed how these vegetative propagation or vegetative uh, reproduction takes place. It is nothing but that is a part of the plant body itself gets modified. It may be the stem modified structure or root modified structure which gets modified and helps in the re or in the reproduction of its own offsprings uh, which will be identical to the parents. So this is how the asexual reproduction takes place in case of the simple plants and also in the case of higher plants. And one more thing, interestingly, we the farmers and some gardeners use this vegetative propagation continuously for the purpose of a commercial use and for the purpose of economical use, where, it, where they gain their life. So, on the other hand, this is leading to a misguidance 
or this is leading some negative points to the nature. So in the next video, let us go through the one more type of a reproduction that is sexual reproduction. Till that, have a good day and enjoy your day. If you like my video, please do subscribe and share it. Thank you.